Hello my beautiful mermaids. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having an amazing Halloween so far. Today is the day that we announced the winner with my first ever giveaway that I've been talking about for a while. Um, I will announce that at the end of the video so you can either fast forward it or just keep watching the tutorial. This I'm going to um, do a mermaid simple look today. Um, I'm going to do a mermaid tutorial uh, just on the eyeshadow part and how to do the scales. I will explain to you like what I use on my eyebrows and my lips and um, everything else I will be showing you guys in this video. So if you are anxious to know or curious to know how I came up with these mermaid scales, then just keep watching. Alright, let's put her hair back. Put your hair back, I guess. I put a bunch of stuff in my hair to give it like a crazy texture and I'm really really regretting it because now it's just so gross feeling. Where are my devil ears? Get me Halloween without devil ears, right? <sighs> Nothing is working for me today. Like how am I supposed to make this stay? there like clip it on there we go that's how we're gonna do it okay so I'm gonna start off with using I'm gonna go with the pink this is the Ur or Urban Decay Woodstock you don't have to use this use any kind of pink you want you need a big fluffy brush I need to do my eyeshadow too. I'm just still debating on what eyeshadow I should do. I hope this goes right. It's a lot easier. It looked a lot easier when that girl was doing it. Taking this purple now. This is not working like I was hoping. It's like really hard to do. I'm about to just rub this all over my. The purple looks more pigmented than the my eyelash off. No. I'm going to take some of my Star Crush Minerals. Because I think these are more pigmented. So I'm going to use these instead. I'm going to use this is Ariel. It's a real pretty green. Oh, that looks nice. What can I? I think I probably just screwed this all up by doing that. Let's open it and see what it looks like. And I fit it up. I mean, it don't look that bad. Tip number one that I realized, I mean, it makes common, it's common sense, but don't pull this off until you're absolutely finished because it'll, it won't be as even. But, hey, we're all beginners, right? And now I'm just going to take this. You're definitely going to need clips. I'm going to keep this clip right here. Just pull it down the side of your face like that. For your contour. Like this. I'm taking the purple that I had. And my Star Crush Minerals. Now I'm just going to contour my face. But with scales. Just do this as much as you like until you are satisfied. It looks like <gasps> wow, that looks cool. Look at that. That turned out nice. I like that a lot. Okay, this one was a screw up. Don't mind that one, guys. I mean, you can kind of see the scales right there, but this definitely looks a lot better. So. That looks cool. I messed up up here. It still looks good. But though. that, it looks cool. Oh, it's 
that off. These eyelashes, they got like little rhinestones on them. That looks okay. Looks okay, right? Alright, y'all. Now time to... Last part of the scales. I'd say this is the easiest part. You can just go like this. I'm gonna dab it this time instead of rubbing it. See if it makes a difference. No, I just keep swatching back and forth between purple and that pretty blue color. Like I said, you can do whatever you want. Like, you can be a red mermaid, but whatever you choose to do. Like, that is all personal preference. Love it! Alright, let's take this funky thing off. I think I'm just leave like this because we're kind of in a hurry to um, get to my parents because my daughter's sick so we can't be out too late tonight. It's, it's like really cold already and be able to go to at least some houses before it gets like freezing outside. So, um, alright start on the eyeshadow. I'm not exactly sure yet what I want to do for the eyeshadow. Yeah, I'm just going to use this. Then we'll see what goes from there. Okay, I'm just going to rub this all over the eyelid. as I was expecting it to be. Oh well, well, we'll figure it out. We always do, right? These Star Crush Minerals, like, they are amazing. But when you start blending them out, they lose their pigment. So I feel like when you're working with these, you kind of just want to dab them instead of blending. I mean, blend a little bit, but lightly, like very, very lightly blend those out. Almost feel like, I think I'm going to take the Urban Decay Moon Dust Palette, and I'm going to take my finger and use the Light Year Green. Let's see what this looks like. And then just like put this on the outer corners. Actually, you know what? Put it all over the eyelid. That's what I'm going to do. Put it all over the eyelid. <laughs> it looks very aerial like, mermaidy like. And this is Halloween, y'all. We ain't got to be perfect. 
I'm a sea animal for God's sakes. I am liking that a lot. I'm just gonna add a little bit more to both sides. I wonder if I added this purple, what it would look like. Should we try it? Yes, I like that. Just put it on the inner corners. Don't rub it all the way out. It almost looks like a mermaid tail on your eyelid. Do you guys see that? It looks so cute. It looks like mermaid tail. And just keep adding it until you are satisfied with it. Y'all, why didn't you tell me? <laughs> okay. Now that I got glitter all over my fingers, I'm going to rub that blue that we used on the island. Actually, I'm no, I'm rubbing the, the purple under my under my waterline, like down here. This is going to be a hot mess by the end of the night, just so you guys know. <laughs> okay. Alright. Now I'm just going to take, like, this highlighter. It's actually, it's by Makeup Forever, and it's an eyeshadow, but I'm going to use it as a highlighter. To just dust everywhere. To really make these scales pop. Just dust them over your scales. Not too crazy because you don't want the scales to lose their scaliness. Yeah. And also just rub it under the brow bone. Okay guys, I finally have the results for the winner. I'm sorry I couldn't go live like I promised. It was just been a very hectic last two weeks. I've been very busy with school and um, I actually got sick with some kind of like stomach virus last week. So I really put me behind on everything. But I'm going to announce the winner. I got two and her name is in the card. So are you ready? Okay, so the card says open if you dare and it says and get yourself something you can really sink your fangs into i thought that was funny because like you can sink your fangs into some new makeup okay so find the kinsey you are my winner i'll be contacting you very soon for your address so i can ship you your stuff and my second winner is Kara M. Fox. I love you both and I wish I could give every one of you something because I love you all. You all support me so much. But yeah, I'll be getting a hold of them and I will be doing another giveaway very soon. I will let you guys know when. Yeah, I will be letting them know very soon. I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for participating and watching me. Bye guys.